Hey guys, welcome to your energy checking for Scorpio. This is going to be for your uh, rest of your November 2024. This is a bonus energy check-in, okay? So uh, we're going to take a look at your overall energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect. Apply this to your own unique situations, like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So what messages do we have here for Scorpio? Over energies for Scorpio. What's surrounding Scorpio? What does Scorpio need to know for the uh, rest of the November 2024 for Scorpio? Okay, so we have the Emperor here, Aries energy. Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. The Ten of Cups here. Okay, that looks good. Ten of Cups. Five of Wands here. Just kidding. <laughs> it seems like things were really happy. Um harmonious here very balanced here but I, I do feel like there's you guys are definitely stepping into some issues here when it comes to you know a relationship or family situation here okay with the queen of wands here aries little sagittarius energy we also have the ace of swords here okay i almost get the feeling here where i feel like some here is having some sort of realization here and i feel like some here is ready to cut ties with someone yeah um Scorpio, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like warning signs are coming in or, 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 or the universe is trying to warn you about someone here that you're dealing with, okay? And I feel like you guys are like finally waking up to this here because I do feel like whoever this is, this is an individual here that's causing issues or drama into your life here with the Tower Aries Scorpio energy with the Knight of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. The Ten of Cups and the Hierophant tier. Okay. <coughs> there is a situation that you're giving too much in, and I feel like it's not being reciprocated or that you're feeling like you're not being respected here. And one of the things I'm getting here is that I feel like it doesn't have to be a romantic relationship. It could be uh, between you. Let's say if you're the parent, okay? It, it could be between a parent and a child here. All right. Let's see. The Five of Wands here. The five of wands yeah it does seem like there's some sort of problematic situation here okay and let's say if this is like a child uh child parent like dynamic here you know it could be something regarding drugs here okay uh maybe at some point here you were uh you know supporting this person's bad behavior here and now you're stopping that okay uh the devil capricorn energy here the queen of wands here this is kind of like a very specific message here for somebody okay yeah, I feel like it's a parent situation with a child here. You know, whoever this person is, this person's definitely using their using your money or using money to do bad stuff here. Okay, we have the Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands here. Ace of Wands. This is so interesting here. I also get the sense that you know when I was uh, uh you know while I'm kind of like. Uh, watching the story unfold here, I do feel like, you know, because of what they were doing here, because of what someone here has been doing, Scorpio, someone here got really ill. Like, I feel like someone here was dealing with, like, stomach issues, okay? And someone here had to get some sort of medical medical treatment surrounding it. And this not, did not snap someone back into reality here, okay? So what else do we have here for Scorpio? Bonus energy check-in for Scorpio. What else does Scorpio need to know? Look out for work on for November, rest of their November 2024. <clears throat> we have the Hermit, Virgo energy. We have the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn Taurus Virgo. We have the Queen of Swords, Libra Aquarius Gemini. We also have the Justice card, Libra energy. Um, what it comes down to is this person's not really being truthful and honest with themselves here. And I feel like this person lacks that integrity here and also lacks some sort of internal compass here. Okay. 
Um, you know, I do feel like whatever this is, you know, I, I do feel like this person is going to have some sort of major aha moment here. Uh, it's not really showing here in the cards here, but you know, I do feel like whatever this is, you know, someone here is going to hit the rock bottom here and someone here is going to come to a realization here where this person is snapping out of this uh, 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 thing that they're in here. Okay. Tell me about the hermit card here. Why is the hermit card here? The hermit, the hermit. And we have the death card here, Scorpio energy. Yeah, someone here is going through some sort of like ego death. Okay, so I'm here is definitely going through some sort of transformation here. All right, you know, obviously, you know, when someone leans into some sort of substance here to run away, to escape, you know, um, it's the ego taking over where this person is in constant fight or fight or flight response here. Okay, so there's a switch. There's a switch that's happening here with this individual. The Knight of Pentacles here. Knight of Pentacles. Nine of Swords. Mm, wow. Wow. Okay, wow. Someone here is definitely going through, yeah, someone here is going through a deep, deep, deep spiritual transformation here. So, it, whoever this is, you know, someone here is snapping out of something here that's really negative here, you know? Something here that's not really adding a value to their life here, and it's definitely, you know, lowering this person's consciousness and their vibration here. So, you know, I do feel like this person's vibration here is going to shift, okay? Uh, you know, if they're kind of like down here, it's going to shift up. It's going to balance out here. Okay. We have the justice card. Why is the justice card here? The justice card. The justice card. Okay. So we have the king of swords here. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. We also have the ace of wands here and the two of swords. Okay. And also the ten of swords here. And we have the sun card. I mean, this could be indication that some of you guys could be making a decision to also cut someone out here too. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's say if your child here is dealing with someone here that was... that. I, I feel like this person had something to do with your person dealing with this here, and I do feel like this person could be cutting this person out here too, okay? So, you know, I, I feel like it's a situation here where this person never dabbled in this before and it was introduced to your person here and this person got caught up in it here and, it, and now they're trying to free themselves from this. Yeah, whoever this is, like there is someone here that's snapping out of this here and making that shift and making that change here, okay? And I really truly believe that this is like a child-parent dynamic where, you know, someone else, someone else's influence affected this child here does that make sense okay so like so scorpio that's why i feel like this is a really really specific reading for someone so scorpio i hope that this was helpful i hope that this resonated if it did leave a comment down in the comment section below like share subscribe hit the notification bell and i will speak to you guys in the next one thanks guys bye